try and go through it, see what happens. Oop, 20 feet. 20 feet. Oh, and... you are down low there. <laughs> and he stopped. <laughs> Hey, what is up, you guys? This is Jared the Gamer here. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're playing some more Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 here, and I'm joined today by Chunk400 and Tasmanite, also known as Brett Plays on YouTube. We are at Tulsa International Airport today, and we're going to be flying along Route 66 to Armadillo, Texas. I got the DC free here, so we're ready to take off, so let's go. Right before we get started, please do me a favor and subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified as soon as I upload a new video. Without further ado, let's begin. When you take off, straight. Uh, turn straight. around. Oh, straight. Straight, is it? Yeah, it's straight. Um, uh, yeah. I've got to look at my, uh, my map again. All right, off we go. This thing takes forever to get From up. Where I can see the Route 66 is slightly, slightly to the left. Because we're going to Oklahoma City first. Oh, I'm taking it with no flaps. Me neither. That works. Oh, we are up. Ah, uh, there's a nice long runway. We don't need flaps. So you have a... Uh, Oh, this sounds so nice. Yeah, this does. All right, do I rotated. Turn yeah. here. So what we do need to do is fly and find the route 66 again. Uh, we might just have to do a circle and pick this, guys. I think there's quite a bit. No, I think. Well, yes and no. They're, they're looking at. Uh, implementing a new way of doing the files so that your old mods don't necessarily work. They're not in a hurry to share their SDK secrets, I'm sure. Because you do see lots of people complaining about oh, uh, yep, the SDK I see you guys. is hard to work out or hard to... All right, I see you guys. So we're just passing Chandler Regional. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna, gonna swoop. On the, uh, All right, I'm gonna swoop on in you guys. I'm going a little too fast, doing about three fifty. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, That's full fl right. full flaps. Got to slow down. Can, what what are we? You can do circles around. Uh, what speed are All you right, currently heading? Two five four at two one three knots. Okay, I'm doing about 185 now, so I should be able to keep up with these. 1,700 feet altitude. So, unfortunately, my stream died. I am recording this. It's just going to have to be the way it is at the moment. Holiday period, too many people nearby using up the internet. I even got up early this morning to do this. It's currently, uh, well, it's actually 9.41 for me now. <laughs> and we are following historic Route 66. Wonder, oh, Main Street of America. We are getting back onto our flight line. What's it, about 20 to 5 for you, Dre? What? Time, is it about 20 to 5? Uh, for me right now, uh, it's 5.41 for, for me. Oh. <coughs> One hour out. It's a bit daylight savings now. Yeah. All right, I'm holding it oh. uh, 14... 80 feet. Uh, okay. okay, I'm at 1400 and climbing slightly. Fortunately, I can't uh, stream this today. We tried. It lasted. How long did it last? Two minutes? Three minutes? <laughs> six know. minutes. Six oh. minutes and six seconds. What a shame. And we actually had collected up to, what, nine people, like I said? And and then, uh, yeah, 
So there's already been 19 watches. Sorry guys, you won't be able to see it. But I will put it as the beginning. Might help to actually watch where I'm going here. All right, so the flight path, if you have your VFR open, you'll see it actually runs straight across this road because we are heading towards Oklahoma. But we're following the road, not necessarily the flight path. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. So we are trying to follow the route to 66 as much as possible. I'm actually getting okay FES for first time in history. Yeah, I'm sitting around 27, 28. I am on 4K though. Yeah, I'm getting like... And everything is set on high. I'm at 1080 and I'm getting 26, but it's jumping around. In case 50. people have just come into the video and fast forwarded, this is 50. 2K. Dang. 50 at 2K. What yeah. video card do you have? Me? Uh, RTX 2070. Oh, all right. Got 20 series. There we go. So I am currently looking out the back window at you guys, <clears throat> at my gunner's uh, point of view, and that is actually pretty cool. Let's see if I can't uh, add a little bit of rock music instead. There we go. That's better music for Route 66. There's Chunk coming up on my uh, right hand wing. I am going to pop back into the front though, make sure I know where I'm going. All right, Ethan's in front of us. Should get Ethan in on our chat so he can talk to us. Would be a good idea. Change my mood. All right. I'm going to have a slight right here. What's uh, the top speed you guys can go? Oh. 360. Two. 280 is a maximum it's and then you're in the yellow uh, um we can go faster if that's what you're after oh uh, no it's fine now now that you can all right i'll give her beans and we'll see just need to line it up straight first i'm flat out 200 yep I'm flat out at 245. Let me turn my prop pitch to full. 245. Autopilot is doing his best to hold at 1580. No, yeah. Ooh, we got a slight climb there. Does the yeah. P51 even have autopilot? Probably not. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not even sure the Bowfight is meant to have autopilot. Certainly makes it nicer to have a look around. Yeah, like, uh, yeah, I don't know if it, oh, and yep, us. I was trying to find it and I ended up flying. I don't even see where you guys are now. Because I was in my cockpit looking around. Oh, there you guys are. A bit. Right, mine's sitting right nice and uh, 1500. Uh, what's uh, how are you guys on fuel? Uh, 91. I'm well, I'm at 41%, so I'm probably going to keep an eye out for a uh, occasional either airport or fuel stop. So now I'm doing 269 um, knots. I'm at 87, and it was 89 a minute ago, and it's dropping pretty quickly. Yeah, well, we are giving it a fair chunk of beans here, so... Ethan's definitely in front of us. I think he might have ended up at the uh, 
I might be at Oklahoma. All right, so looking at, we were supposed to go down through Oklahoma City. So let's have a look at my Google Maps again. Right, yeah, so probably actually can turn in there. So see this uh, road ahead? We want to take a left and go through Oklahoma City. Oh, I am I am racing ahead of you guys. Two sixty nine. Yeah, got to two seventy one. I'll just back off here because we're going to turn left at this junction. Are we racing the sun? I'm, am I on weather and the sun's about to go down? Um, Maybe. Yep. Oh, that was actually a nice flyover. All right, I got live time and live weather. Um, Let's have a look at the local weather here. So 4.48 p.m. Yeah, okay. Am I on live? I am. Okay, so I am actually on live weather. Right. Sorry, Ethan, you, know, you need to come into our chat so I can work out where we are. So I'm going to follow this main road down from what I can see on the um, Google Maps. We head down here and then turn right at Oklahoma City and go back. When we head out on the uh, number, it's kind of two ways and going. Go, could have kept going around and then we've got to do a sharp right, sharp up left, a 90 degree left. No, I see it on the VFR there. I had an idea for a potential flight simulator series I could do with you guys. How would it, how would you guys think of a flight series from Rio to Tokyo? What, in a pop of love? Mm -hmm. yeah. No, in a commercial, in a, like a jet airliner. <laughs> yeah, what in? Uh, jet airliner, like any airliner. I was thinking of using an A330. Commercial? Yeah. All right, what are you playing the car? What? I didn't catch that, sorry. Whoa, come find out. An A330, as in one flight or no, uh, multiple? Uh, multiple? Multiple. One flight, right. multiple. Uh, it'd be like two flights, I think. Like, I would fly oh, from, man. I was thinking flying from Rio to Halifax and then from Halifax to Tokyo because there's no, because an A330 doesn't have enough range to fly all the way from Rio to Tokyo. So we would have to make a pit stop, but... Right. Maybe? I'll right, so I'm just going to skip, skip mm -hmm. Oklahoma. See you there. Looks beautiful. Sorry, what was though. that? You'd rather what? Looks beautiful though. Things seem different to an A380 or whatever. That was close. Yeah. Well, depending on how many stops you're planning on doing, uh, I plan. I, I'd even consider a 727F, 200F, the uh, freight version. Take like a uh, DHL or a FedEx or something. I was considering, uh, well, I'll, I'll let you know more on Discord, because I don't have it all planned out yet. All right, so we're past Oklahoma City. We are actually now following the flight route, which is actually pretty good, but I'm following this main road down here where Chunk's just gone down below me. It's pretty low, Chunk. 
Yeah, I'm in like I might just have to join you. Oh, yeah, I was at 1700. I think he was about 500. Yeah, uh, yeah, he was for a second. All right, now we're down. Down with the traffic. Oh, yeah, I go low. Chunk goes even lower. Under the bridge, Chunk. Under the bridge. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah let's go under you the bridge. Do it, mate. <laughs> yeah, let's go under the bridge. Oh. Oh. You can't go under bridges. <laughs> no, I can't. It just bounced me up. You can go through them. You can. Try the next one. Like that. Yeah. Oh, watch out for those power lines. Oh, I just chopped. Uh, in real life, I would have just chopped the trailer off semi truck. Oh. All right, I'm going to try and go through it, see what happens. Oop, 20 feet, 20 feet. And... Oh, you are down low there. <laughs> <laughs> and he stopped. <laughs> <laughs> we learned. When we did the Tiger Moth, did we turn there? <laughs> yes, right. we do. We're going to follow that road. And it turns back the other way yes okay all right i'm catching up on you guys oh we're only just over how long don't you they do you get better roads That's true. Maybe we just need to fly higher. At least one thing in that P-51 you can keep up. Yeah. Uh, we're going past EJ. He's on the other side there. He's a K KPWA. I need to give uh, Ethan a message and say, hey, come join. I don't know if he's on my Discord or not. Page Mun is where we're going past. Page Municipal Airport. That's what that'll be. Oh, you're below me. Yep, yep, you just went over the top. Thirty eight percent fuel. I'm at sixty nine percent. EJ the goat had was along with us, but um he may have actually seen us I pass him. Where are we going? Is that the road we're going to take? Yes, it is. And then um, it goes down south. All right, so on the VFR map, you can see it goes up past 280K or 280K. Follow that road. That will be the one we want. And then it will come back down into where we're going. All right, good. Yeah, we're doing good. Uh... Where are we going to stop for fuel? Because I think I'm going to need fuel on this trip. I oh, I'm definitely going to need fuel. I'm at 38% already. But I figured there's enough airports out there. I'm sure we can find one. So how do we refuel? Do we just land and um, uh, just hit the refuel button and just add fuel within the, in the little menu? Is that how we do it? Or you can actually, oh, right, yeah, you can request refueling. Call over, call over the, yep, yep. Well, we, we kind of pretend to call the guy in his uh, pickup truck to come over with a jerry can and just say, can you top us up? Thanks, mate. But uh, essentially exactly how you said it. <laughs> yeah. Yes, we just use the fuel button. 
I mean, we can do it in the air, but where's the fun? In yeah, exactly. No. That's what makes these simulators so fun. Is that like you? That's what makes them so Bubble. fun. Is you when you use your imagination because fly simulators themselves aren't that interesting unless you kind of use your imagination. Pause. Oh, chunk on the ground? No, chunks above you. Imagination. Inverted. Oh, I'm getting really bad in. Oh, I just saw him that there, yeah. Now, from a moment there, it looked like he was uh, belly rubbing the ground. All right, I'm going to do a barrel roll. Nice. Yeah, I'm doing extremely low now. I'm doing probably 20 feet. Can't see you there. All right. It's actually turning automatically for me. Wait, are we following the road? Or is my autopilot actually off and it just happened to be doing that? <laughs> well, that was weird. It, it turned for me. Cool. Like, I love it. I just know what I'm wanting. All right. I do love the sound and radio. I got a sound. A bit off the road there. Let's get back over. We're out 66, and I think we are going to land right around sun. That's it. Yeah, it should look nice. Should be beautiful. The uh, sun going down at Amarillo is time. That might be something I might look up online. I think actually we're going to cross into a time zone, actually. I think we might. Oh, chunks going inverted. Cross into what? Uh, and, uh, so, oh, uh, yep, I just hit the ground. Uh, uh, we might cross into the central time zone for the United States. Yeah. Sundown at 5.47 p.m. Amarillo today. And what are we? We're in UTC. No, local. There we go, 5 p.m. We just hit 5 p.m. So we've got 47 minutes till the sun goes down. And I am way offline. What happened there? Too busy surfing the internet. <laughs> All right, we got another guy joining us. Looks like Hyperkite. I don't know if he's from the Discord or not. Hey, Hyperkite's here. Awesome. He is. He's on mute at the moment. Welcome, Hyperkite. Sorry, mate. We uh, tried streaming it and it failed. So glad you can join. You can unmute and talk if you want. I am recording. Chunk streaming. And I'm recording too. There we go. Hey, there he is. Hey, there he is. Microsoft did an update. So I've been sitting at the uh, screen waiting for them to update. <laughs> How's that? Oh, oh no. Yes. Wait, Flight Sim, Flight Sim did an update. Yep. I, screen, oh, I got I a screenshot. That. I've never seen it. They wouldn't let me in. Uh, so I finally force closed it, and it just says press any oh. key to start. I just kept doing it. And, oh uh, no, yeah, that's a that's a bug issue. Yeah, you gotta restart yep. completely. I've had that, not recently, but I've had that like a few weeks ago. Yep. And it just goes round and round. You just sit there. It's like no. press uh, no. any key to start. Press any key to start. Press any key to start. I'm like I'm pressing any key. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, are and it ain't gonna, working. Uh, are we going to nope. land at Hinton Mun? It's about two miles away, and we're all kind of long. Do you here. do you want to land at Hinton Mun? Mm, I have about half a tank. I have about you know what? Half a tank. I'll, I'll, I'll accept. Yeah, right, I'll accept that. Let's go to Hinton Mun. Okay, then. Uh, let me contact ATC. Nah, yeah. I'm, the, I'm just going to land. My okay, game just crashed. Oh, no. Okay, there's no ATC here anyways. It's just a, there's not like tower. You just announce it. And okay, All right, I'm not gonna worry about that. I'm gonna worry more about landing. 
I'm gonna uh, I, come I, in from a long run. I'm going way too fast, so I'm just gonna go around. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm I'm going too fast to land there, so I'll uh, I'll bring it out from around here. Hyperkite, if you want to uh, land here as well, uh, depending uh, on your fuel status, you probably just spawned in, but I don't know if you're put in 100%. No, I think I'm at 50. Yeah, I'd land. All right, we're going to make our way to yeah, Amarillo. Yeah, I'm going to swing around and land with you guys. All right, All right. gear out. We had uh, Ethan before, but he's not uh, he's not caught up to us, so... Oh, freezing. Oh, man, that was annoying. Oh, I'm going to crash. Yep. <laughs> All right, I'm just I may land in the grass at this rate. I did a smooth but like drift landing on a field, which was kind of funny. Well, I almost put my rear wheel down there. Oh, 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 that was a bit solid. Turn these uh, propellers down. See if we can actually stop without uh, shoving the nose into the ground. And Dre's going to land right where I'm uh, yep. taxiing. All right, let me just see if I can get off the end of the taxi. You can go over the top of me. Yeah. Actually shortcut the grass, and that's nice. P-51 coming in right behind me. Bounced a little bit, but wasn't that too bad of a landing. You going to fuel up at the uh, building over there? Yeah, yeah. If, if there is a fuel stop there, I'll actually go to it. Thank Let's you. Turn this music down a little bit more. Yeah, yeah, there is a fuel stop. Yeah, there is. And yeah, there's a van there. Awesome. So hopefully Chunk's on his way back in. I'm just spawning on you now. Okay. So Hinton Mun is the airport you can take off at if you want. Hinton Municipal. Oh. Uh, it comes up as... On the all right, I actually just comes up as two all right. Yeah, I'm just uh, I'm just coasting. If we can get Ethan to come and join us again, or maybe he's still in his Po O two. He's way back there. Oh, he's Po two. Yeah, I don't think he's taken off. I mean, he could just he's spawn. Waiting in. for it to come to. He should just Oklahoma spawn. or not. You should just spawn in here where we all are. I'm not sure what his nickname is on Discord to send him a message, so... At the moment, it's like... Oh, well. Oh, chunk, Chunk's coming in. Yes, he is, and he's got a different vi yeah. aircraft now. <laughs> he's got the P-40. Oh, funny thing happened. So when I first tested this mod out... And I was waiting for it to taxi. At bang camp? Uh, Sorry, I couldn't resist that. <laughs> and I was first, when I first got this mod and I was uh, testing it out, I waited for it to taxi onto the runway. And then, of course, it turned on the parking brake. Except it did it so hard. Yeah, that the, nose the, up. Yeah, nose flew straight into the yeah. ground. Straight into the ground. Extremely hilarious, though. Can't get close enough for fuel here. Oh. oh, wait, you could put your park brake on. Oh, there we go. Thank you. I'm going to take a full thing of fuel because it looks like everybody else is going faster planes now. Okay, now I just got to come in and get fuel. I have to do a pushback. This is lovely. It's fine. There's no pushback. Okay, I'm going to... That's the P-40? Yes. That's for the P40X, though. I've got a new P40. I downloaded another one, which I think will should work. All right. I am going to take a full tank This all tank works. Of... All the pages work. All right. I'm going to take a full tank of fuel. I mean, it's only got one prop. That one's got the, the uh, counter rotating. Yeah, yeah. This is awesome. So I got one that is just a standard um, P40 that I'll uh, bring out soon. One of my 17 that I have installed. 
All right, I'm going to go back down here since the wind is going that way and we want to get back onto that road. All right, oh, and I just went to... Whoa! <laughs> Somebody just ran into a building. Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to spawn probably... You might want to just, like, slew over a little. So are you yeah. both in the silver number six, or is that just... Or sorry, number nine? Or is that just all I can see? All right. Right, okay. It looks like it's me. Wow, there's almost not enough tarmac here to keep both wheels on, on it. Wow, and I've already oh, no, used right. one. Per, I've used one percent of fuel and just the half, and just <laughs> probably the not even a minute that I fueled up. Sun's going down. Seen. Where do these clouds it's come from? I didn't see clouds here before. Yeah, me neither. It was all clear when we landed. Okay, my plane oh. does not want to respond to my The controls. weather updated. Right here. Okay, now we're right on the taxiway. Guys, I'm not going to wait for you because you guys got the faster planes. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's already. fine. Yeah, that's fine. Take off. I had the slew. <coughs> All right. If you can see the uh, the VFR map heading north, there's a road that goes east west. We're heading west on that road. That's the Route 66 that we're uh, trying to follow. Okay, got tail up. Hey, gentle lift. Thank you very much. Gear up. Right, see if I, can, we can I cannot get. See you guys take off. Yeah, I can't stay in that view very long. Use the road. Yeah, yeah I'd say the uh, the weather updated. Okay, I cannot get over here back to the airport, so I'm just going to take off right here from a random field. Okay. It's kind of windy. I'm sitting at 1950. Yeah. I, I noticed there's a, another mode for FSX flight, which might be good for that video that I released last night. Uh, uh, do you have the Yak 40 mod? Uh, the Draken, so the uh, Saab 35J. No, I don't believe I have, have any Yaks. Uh, because it, well, I, I installed it and it didn't work, and I thought maybe I just did it wrong, but I, I, I'm just wondering if anyone else has it. All right, there's a guy above us. Can yes. You... Best way to to uh, check if they'll work, and it's not a guarantee because sometimes they work even without an interior. But the interior model is very important. If the FSX one doesn't have the interior model, you're not going to have much luck. Now, EJ is right behind us, but is he still at Oklahoma? Or is he coming with us? I'm not sure. Time zone. 5.11 p.m. What do we have till? 5.47 to get to... Hyper uh, is way uh, where down are we going? Me. Amarillo. Keep an eye out for uh, towns and cities here. About how fast are you guys going? Uh, I'm doing, I'm doing two, 212. I'm 280, but I'm going to slow down in a bit so I can kind of 259. Okay. Pick it up. I'm at full power too. So at the moment, 259 in this environment is about all I'm going to get. 218 371 
No. Is that all you can do? 218 in the... Yeah, he's flat P40? Out. At level. All right. Well, I'll slow down then. I'm sure it should go faster. Put your flaps up. I have. But it's showing I'm just still checking. Down. <laughs> they're showing they're still down. Yeah, it's still showing 24 degrees. All right, so the flaps are not working at the moment. No. Because normally it would go faster than that. Yeah. So, did we go past Elk City or not? I'm not sure. Stafford. All right, there's a city I can work out where we are. I'm just trying to work on the map, Google Maps, where Stafford is. Well, Stafford might be the airport. Get to go through Sh Shamrock. Cool. Find it. Whoa, we're getting a bit of wobbles there. Yeah, me too. We've got a few wind turbines <laughs> coming up. Oh, I always love flying through those and Grand Theft Auto V. <laughs> That's always funny. We've got a uh, left <laughs> dog leg here and then a right dog leg. How's everybody else going? Yep, cool. Chunk, you've caught up? Yeah. So it's doing all right? Yeah, I've got a little bit of height and then drove it down, got up to about 250. Right. Um, I'll uh, pump it going again because at the moment, my sun's going down. Yeah, me too. Sun's getting low, mm -hmm. big fella. So that's a uh, incredible whole meme <laughs> or uh, saying in case you didn't know. <laughs> Nobody said anything like, yeah. Uh, that joke went down <laughs> like a like a ton of green Hulk. I've been called a lot worse. Wow, good Ooh, decent man. Right, no. <laughs> I believe we have about another. Yeah, check a clap, bud. I believe at this rate we're going to be going for another uh, hour what? or so. At this rate, another hour or so. Yeah. Can we just go around Old, uh, Elk City? Uh, well, I don't see K. MA yeah, or right. anywhere on the map. And I'm following, like, no, okay. What is Kajo? Uh, am I going to be high enough to go over these? Oh, yep. And there's uh, my first oil pump down there, is it? On oh, no, those trees. Wow, that's pretty close. All right, I'm going to try and weave in between these turbines. Which is yeah, <laughs> that's not save um i don't have my flight plan set up are we about halfway on this voyage uh, i don't know um clinton regional you can find out where Clinton Regional is, but uh, the final flight is a straight into Amarillo, by the looks of it. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. All I know is it's going to be a nice big file and it's going to take a, night, a whole night or two to upload. Everything's in 4K. Yeah. So I hope you're enjoying this. I don't know if everybody will watch the whole thing. I seem to with the stream. Maybe a little less with an upload like this. Uh, most of my viewers who watch my streams, at least my, my at least my flight simulator streams, they usually come in for like five minutes and then leave, and then someone else comes in and so on and so forth. Because I don't think most people have patience for a free hour stream. <laughs> no. No, look, 
all the streams, not not all streams are going to be everything that people like to see. Uh, it depends whether they're also looking on their mobile phone. I know when I watch other people's streams, because I, I don't just stream, I actually watch other people's stuff as well. Actually, just looking at where we are, I think we might have just gone past Elk City and we have to say, yeah, say, say, I'm not even sure how to pronounce that. Um, yeah, people come and go. Look, that's, that happens. Uh, I know even when I get up to um, go make a cup of coffee, my mobile phone turns off, so I'm off the stream. And then when you click it and it comes back on, it's like, it looks like someone's gone and come back or a new person's come back. Yeah. We have an A320 cruise, you know, like 35,000 feet. I actually wonder where he is. Who's that? Tonka Truck S, Tonka Truck 79. I'm not sure I've seen him before. I he's in he's an A free he's in an A free twenty and he's cruising at uh around thirty four five around thirty five thousand, but I think he's pretty far away. We are passing what are you going right below me? We're passing KCSM. Let's see where that airport is. That is Clinton Sherman Airport. All right, so we are, where is Clinton Sherman? Holy schmoly, you're right. We are a long way to go. Do we only get that far? No, we're nowhere near Elk City. That's the next big one. All right, and now I know where we are. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna go try, I'm gonna try and keep up with a uh, hyperkite. I'm going low with the traffic. I know, kind of imagine what. Are we going chunk? Are we going too fast? Do all right. I'll, I'll sit here. That's no worries. Two hundred and twenty-two. Oh, wonder, I'm doing two sixty-one now. I wonder what it'd be like watching like P fifty-one soar right above you, maybe just a few feet above your car <laughs> in real life. I, I now kind of think about that. <clears throat> Wouldn't last long. True. Unless you're going really fast, it's basically a real, and you're like, oi, that was a bit low. What was that? <laughs> there might be a few choice words depending on who's saying it. <laughs> a few bleepity bleep bleeps. <laughs> I watched some YouTube videos years ago of uh, Russian jets flying over uh, highways at extreme speeds, really low. Yeah, I've seen scaring those. the crap out of people. Yeah, I've seen those videos. Did you see the one where there was like a helicopter flying over a car, and then the guy in the car tries to follow do the helicopter. Oh. He goes like top speed. <laughs> no, I haven't seen that part. It's probably the one that's in my feed at the moment. Now, where does that road go? It goes around. Well, I'm going to go straight ahead. You're going to go straight? You're not going to go around the outside of town? Oh, well, I'm not going to go around the town. No, the Route 66 goes straight in the town. Yeah, That's the whole, the whole town. point of it. Yeah, just like yeah, in uh, it's like, no, 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 no. Stop going like around they town. Built that highway a few years ago. Look at that. Huh? Oh, we got Spit Biffa bike behind us. Oh, am I descending? I am too. Well, I was a little low. Maybe we'll take that back up. Let's get that straight, thank you. Hold altitude. Thank you. There we go.
Okay, we're turning left here. Yep. We are heading a little more south. All right, so Clinton, so that was Foss. So then we go down to Canute. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Or is this Foss here? No, Foss is where we went. We went through town, not, not around it, I think. It's hard to tell. Turning right. Oh, I could have went under that bridge. Wish I thought of that. Funny thing happened. So, the other day I was flying with my A330. And I was doing a long call flight to St. Petersburg from uh, JFK with some friends. And uh, one of the guys behind it, we were, it was like three other people and one guy behind us crashed and I kept flying. <laughs> and then the guy behind me asked me, who, uh, and then he goes, shouldn't we wait for him? And my response was, we're not the U.S. Marines, so we leave a man behind. Oh, oh, cruel. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put a map on my stream here to try and work out where we are. So if you are watching this on recorded, uh, so we, well, this is where we're running, past Oklahoma City and coming in to Amarillo. We are in here coming up between Clinton and Elk City. Should be getting in around Canute and I need to straighten up because the road turned. And that sun's getting pretty low. I'm going as fast as I can, 400 knots and ooh. And the red is at lost 500. chunk. I'm here. I reds at three fifty. Mine's at like five hundred, but I don't stop with the red. No, there you are. You're right next to me. Okay. Oh, I can't do it. I can barely get to the yellow. Probably in a dive is where I could do that. I'm in the yellow. Let's see if we can see chunk out the back. Yes, I can. Oh, he's almost in my gun sight. <laughs> <laughs> deck, 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 deck. No, he's gone down below. I can't even... Oh, there he is. Oh, oh, he just went past the gun sights, but off to the left. Pretty cool, this plane. Shame this one a bit quicker. Now, we're going to run out of road on the, um, on the VFR map. Is this Elk City? I think it is. The amount of turn on this, I'm having an idea that it might actually be Elk City. It doesn't look like a very big city. Whoa. Who just went straight up? That was me. Is that Chunk? Only way I can keep up. I mean, I'm on I, I'm on a pause right now because I want to get a few nice uh, pictures because and my linear came out for some reason. Going to the right? Yeah, we're following it to the right, and then it should go to the left again, and then we run out of VFR map. So what we'll have to do is uh, follow Google Maps, which is what I'm doing, or I'm sure uh, Microsoft would like us following Bing Maps. Oh, well, I'm flying at 270. Is that too much for your... Wait, are you in Spitfire now? Oh, no. no, I'm in the same oh. one. Is 270 too much? Don't worry, you carry on. All right. I'm at 37. At the moment, we are racing the sun. Um... What? Your engine shut off. Did you run out of fuel? Nope. 
think so. What? Uh, oh, I did it! Wait a second! Wait. <laughs> I didn't look. Did you not time. fill up with fuel? No, I put. Uh, no, I didn't. I didn't top it off. What uh, fuel level are you guys at right oh, now? Oh no! Yeah, I put. Yeah, I'm at ninety-two percent. I'm at thirty-six. All right. I'm at 36 percent. Yeah, and I filled up all the way. Wow! All right. And yeah. look, stop at an airport when you see one nearby. All right. Yeah, I am one, but there's nobody here. <laughs> Just call the guy in his pickup truck to come and fill it up. Got it. <clears throat> fill it up. <laughs> I like to uh, park out in the desert and walk it and walk to the closest town with my own jerry can. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Uh, we're going to follow the road, even though it disappears on our VFR, but this should actually take us all the way to Amarillo. All right, there is an airport not too far from me, about five miles, so... Yep, Haddock. So you're all out there, Hyperkite? Yep, taking off. Wow, I, I can see what looks like a cloud underneath you. Is that where you hit the dust, was it? Wait, no, I actually got out of the runway. Wait, Hyperkite. All oh, right. Hyperkite, are, you, at, are you at uh, Paddock? Or had it? Uh, oh, no, he's behind us. Yeah, yeah. Oh. All right. He's behind us. You, you got a haddock? Yeah, yeah, I ran out of gas at the airport, so that was good. Chunk, you need more fuel? I'm 75%. Oh, you're good on that one. All right. It's the B51s that are right. using up all the fuel. All right. I mean, I guess I was, oh, like, gunning the heck out of this thing. I was doing, like, 420, 430 ish, so. Alright, see if we can level this off. Are we getting a little bit of turbulence? I think I'm coming in too fast to land here. Might have to do a go around. I'm, I'm just going to let you guys catch up. I don't even see where there's a runway. Is this like a. Oh, this is a dirt strip. It's a grass strip. You're asking one of the farmers to siphon some fuel out of his uh, pickup truck. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully it's not a diesel. Otherwise, you'll be smoking the whole way. <laughs> there is actually a pavement. There is actually a paved runway here, but it's extremely narrow. So I, I don't think my... Yeah, it's not be. even a municipal or anything. This is like a private airport. All right, I'm a... I'm gonna get out of my plane and go over to the farmhouse and uh, ask him, ask him for to siphon some gas. Yeah. Take your wallet. <laughs> All right. I don't have enough cash, so I'm gonna have to write a check. But that's no big deal. I can always. Oh just, yeah. Yeah, I'll I'm sure that'll go down well. Yeah, I'll just <laughs> I'll just call the bank and cancel the check. Problem solved. <laughs> All right. Oh, look at that! There's the truck truck stop. It reminds me of. Uh... Truck Weybridge reminds me of um, American Truck Simulator. Yeah, me too. All right. I'm like, oh, please let me give me a green light. I just want to keep going. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I've had a few people ask me, oh, can you uh, download the multiplayer and, and do it? So maybe I will. I'll do a few uh, recorded videos of that because I need to get back into recording that. I had a few subscribers. I might have lost them because I stopped doing American Truck Sim. Sorry, you guys. Should. If that's what you're into as well. You should do a uh, Euro Truck Simulator. That's a funny game. Yeah, I haven't done much with Euro Truck. All right, Hyperglide's coming in maximum speed. I'm guessing. Yes. Ninety-four percent, and I just took off. Six percent in what? Minute and a half. <laughs> oh, I passed you guys. Take off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Let me turn around. Oh. How'd you get past me? Did you just do a quick slew? Actually, it won't slew. I can go up, but I can't go forward or back. I know, it's a long story. Um, Numpad. The, uh, the flight share program that I use, it's a mapping software. Uh, uh, actually, it does auto landing, waypoints. Right. Automatically, so I just click. I clicked it, and it actually teleported me to where I needed to go. The first time I've used it. Because the slew wouldn't work. I couldn't huh. understand why. Yeah, when I got to the airport, I took off because I couldn't get it to slew when I hit the building. All I could do was go up, but I couldn't go forward or back with the num keys. And lift do you key have an off. Xbox controller? Yeah, I do, sitting right next to me. 
I use mine for that, and you press, uh, just go toggle forward or backwards, and it, it works. Oh, you guys uh, use controllers? Oh, I'm using my joystick. For slewing or for um, for viewing. So I'm going past Shamrock. All right, now we know where we are. Shamrock. All right, 420 knots. Okay. I'm still struggling to catch oh, up with no. you guys. Shove that on the screen. There's so Shamrock there. Wasn't on. That's what was going on. Now the yeah, need a number up on. Then yeah, we got no. McLean, Alan Reed, Groom, and then we into Amarillo. Yeah, yeah, we're almost there. We're All right, hopefully you guys saw that. Yeah, we're booking it. Look at all the planes, though. There's a lot of AI traffic. Now I'm going to try and land before the sun goes down because uh, it is getting low. All right, we're going to fly through Shamrock. I've already used 22% of fuel and I took off about three minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> you may need to lean it out a bit. Now, I'm trying to catch up to you guys, but I should have enough to, according to my, I believe, yeah, I should have enough to get to Armadillo. How many of you guys uh, played Red Dead 2? watched my wife play it she's got it on uh, Xbox One I played number one and finished everything pretty much uh, I didn't bother doing the gambling because I can't be bothered doing that um, I'm not much into gambling to be honest so I just didn't do it Hi, Kai, what plane is that? you got a P red delivery red and blue oh it is the yep. P51 still on Yep. All right, I see you in like red and blue livery. It's uh, I had Cloud Dancer on here. I can't remember this one. I haven't used this one before. Right. Uh, red, white, and blue, but it's got stars on the wings. Look oh, right. yeah, no, that's probably what I see. Um, let's see. Can I read it? It says Mrs. I have to zoom in. Let's see here. Can I zoom in? Let's see what it is. 457 knots. Are you coming up next to me? me? Yep, I'm coming up next to you. It's too dark. Alright, now I'll lean it out. Yeah, his looks red and blue as well. Red, white, and blue. So I'm seeing the same plane for both of you. I'm not sure how far back Chunk is. I kind of wish they'd tell us the distance to other players. I'm trying to catch up. Yep. I'm flying in Miss America. Oh, I Miss, just America. Miss America. Now, I see a monument on the horizon that looks like that monument from uh, Close Encounters, the third kind, off on the horizon to the far right. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'll take that as a no. No, no, I, no I, I don't see it. It's probably just a uh, glitch that happens when the graphics doesn't like loading in stuff. I do you see McLean Gray? Is that County Airport? No. Nope. Yep. Yep. Oh, oh no, right. I do. I'm waiting for you guys. Take a quick picture. Shove that in uh, Discord. So you can see what I'm seeing. Yeah, I'm gonna make a nice. Uh, probably gonna use this as our thumb, my thumbnail. Yeah, I'll turn off the name tags and. Get another thumbnail. Where are you? Right behind you. Wait, behind? Yeah. Oh, up there. Okay. Oh, I hear someone else. There we go. You're up above me. All right. There we go. And what plane yeah, a bit are you hard on? when you turn off all the name tags. Pardon? What plane are you in? Me. The bow fighter. 
Yeah, so showcase yeah. number 55. Gotcha. Okay. 55. And it is beautiful. Uh, what do you think made your channel take off? Because, like, I noticed that after about, after right after you started the Hobart to Heathrow series, that's when your channel, like, took off. Um, I found a niche. Oh. So the deal is, uh, I also did a lot of the, um, uh, instructional videos by YouTube of how to grow your channel. So I did a lot of their, their pre-made videos and just watched them and learned stuff and changed stuff. Um, pick a subject. What is it that you're going to do on your channel? If your channel is video games, then any video game works. If your channel is, uh, you know, camping or hiking and you do video games and camping and hiking or uh, how to fix lawn mowers, for instance, or painting lawn mowers. What type of audience are they going to get? Are they going to watch all your stuff or are you going to lose them when they don't see content that they're there for? I try and post a little bit of everything. I see you watch my, uh, my uh, New Year's Eve video. Yes, sir. I did. I saw your lawnmower stuff. But that's what I'm saying is if you are getting an audience that is interested in that, then why are they going to be interested in your other stuff that is totally different? So kind of pick a subject. My subject is modifying games mostly. And when I'm doing mods, as you can tell what we're flying right now, it's mods. This is what I do. This is my niche. This is what I like doing. Oh. This is what I've been doing since 2002, Flight Sim. Wait, how old are you if you've been playing Flight Simulator? So for... I just show them off. So what <laughs> happened? Well, I've been playing Flight Simulator since the 90s. How old are so you? So I, I am 48 years old. Oh. Or 48 years young. So I'm born in the early 70s. Dude, I, got you by, I got you by 16 years. You got me by 16. Yeah. You're 16 years older yep. than myself. Right. You're not my oldest subscriber, though. No, no. My no, oldest subscriber is, I think, 78. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Yep, and he's flying with me as well. So you've got a vast audience. My average audience, though, is between uh, 24 and 35. Yeah, yeah, same with me for some reason. But I think... Well, if they're into flight sim, they're, they're, that's what they're into. That's, that's their age group. I, right. I know my I videos know appeal going. to a lot of people in my local area who are actually kids, but... Right. They, but of course, not everyone puts in their real age when they set up their Google account. So I think twenty-four or twenty-five to thirty-five. I don't know how that can't be entirely accurate, because I never, I didn't set my real age for my Google account. I never do. Oh, I did. I put my year of birth. All they need to do is tell the year of birth, your birth date on it. I always set mine for like 1967. I said, there's red. <laughs> well, then you get old ads. You get things like pensioners, uh, insurance <laughs> ads, and stuff. Yeah, and that's right. Healthcare. Yeah, that's what I get from my face. That's what I get oh, from my Facebook feed. Oh, some somebody's chunks in an S3. Good on you, mate. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, well, you're the only one to blame for that, then. <laughs> there is definitely a mountain off to the right there. It is massive. So I'd say it's a conflict in the uh, graphics. All right. So we're coming up towards uh, our airport there. We are following the uh, Route 66, though. But we will probably have to veer off to the right to get into the airport. That's, that's fine. Then we'll start from there. All right, the sun is about halfway down. Hopefully, we should be able to land. Right I, know, the I know, I know. The lights are coming out. the uh, The wind turbines have all got their red lights on top. 
see traffic lights. So I'm trying to beat the sun here. Yeah, that's why I didn't bother stopping or landing and I've got 85% fuel. I should have just filled up in the first place. This is also not my first YouTube channel. Wow, what was your... So I have... It had other video gaming in it as well. Test Drive Unlimited for one. Uh, and those... I had views of like... 20 and 30,000 on those things. Uh, I was also doing triple monitor um, long before anybody was doing triple monitor. So I was using CRT screens. And then when LCD screens came out, I still had 15 inch LCD screens on at one stage. Or three 21 inch CRT monitors, Trinitron, Sony, flat screen yep. stuff. What, what was your uh, old channel name? can't tell you it's my private one so i'm not going to broadcast that one because oh. i now watch everything with that so i only got as far as 24 subscribers oh or or i lost a lot of subscribers i'm down to 24 because i i deleted everything on my channel except a few private stuff oh i um what's your so i basically culled it what's your most popular video views wise uh, on this particular channel? Yeah. Current, currently, it's the F14. Showcase number 13. How many views? So, the have? F14, uh, I don't know, 13,000 or something? My most, my most popular video is a plane crash video from GTA 5, and that is about 700,000 now, or close to 700,000. Nice. Now, you got to remember, though, my channel is only five months old. Yeah, I've been doing this for five years, and I haven't gotten very far. Uh, I do have another person asking me, oh, how do you grow your channel? Um, put lots of videos out. Basically. Yeah, I mean, I have 122,000 views, I think, in five months because I have a lot of content, yeah, 122,000. People are interested in certain things. Not, people aren't interested in everything, though, and that's fine. <laughs> I don't have to be. I'm cool with that. I kind of do like the idea, though, of having a small channel. Like, you know, like if because if you're one of those people with, like, millions of subscribers and thousands of comments, you can't really heart everybody's mm -hmm. comment or any of that stuff and then people get offended hello yeah 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 at the moment i can uh respond to everybody's okay. comment mm -hmm. and i pretty much do but uh yeah eventually it'll get to a stage potentially that i won't be able to get everybody's comment but that may just have to be uh, same with streaming i try and actually read everybody's comment even those that write in some other language i have to yeah. translate it yeah that's what i, I had one the other day streams. And some guy uh, swore in whatever language he was uh, writing it in. I didn't actually see what it was. And I just didn't read it out loud. I was like, okay, thank you for your comment. Inappropriate. Michael no thanks. Floods you move on. Sporting. Who's that? Hello. That is Captain Zeeb. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> <laughs> aye, aye, Captain. Now, we're <laughs> almost landing, so we're coming into K-A-M-A. -A. I can't join. I need to go to sleep. You can't join? Where are you? Okay. Where are you from? Norway. Oh, he's from Norway. He used to be DJ Zeeb. Now he's Captain Zeeb. Yes. And I don't know how to pronounce his name because I keep butchering it, so I'm not going to. But he's happy to call me Captain Zeeb. Do that. So we're coming in, uh, I'm actually recording mine. Uh, Chunk is actually streaming it, or was. I think he still is. I saw it. So you can yes, actually see his. Okay, cool. And I've got Dre the Gamer with us here yep. as well. Hello. Uh, he is recording his and will upload later like myself. Nice. So I started the stream and it died. Yeah, Six so, minutes in. Yeah, same happened to me last week. Keep the internet up. 
Yeah, I don't think it's YouTube. I think it's just it is um, it is just my internet and the holiday period. All right, there is our little international. Microsoft Flight Simulator is finally working. Oh, good. So next, I watched next um, stream. Oh. I'm joining. Okay, awesome. My streams have slowed down while the holiday period is here. I just turn the volume down. My a bit. I need to go. Hi. All right, bye bye. You got to go. Yes. All right. I need to go. Say like so, yeah. Captain, babe. Yeah. See you, Captain. What? Hang on, Captain. There's Chunk. Chunk doing circles mm -hmm. over me. I do like those jets. This one you can go quite slow. Oh, uh, what runway are you, you guys landing at? I have twenty-two. Oh, I probably should ask for permission, shouldn't I? Good idea. Rick Husband. Is that the name of the airport? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, it is not giving me... Well, hopefully I don't have to go around because I'm, I'm kind of lining up quite nicely here. I'm not lined up, so I'm going to be surfing. 22. All right, the sun is just about to set, and I'm low on fuel anyway, so I'm going to have to fill up, fuel up. 22. Oh, okay. Hang on. That's this one there. All right. So I presume that we're going to be, like, spending the night here, and then in the next stream, it'll be... We will hunting. spend as long as we need to here, yes, and we will go and potentially grab a new airplane when it gets delivered. And then we will announce to everybody that we're going to take off from here. Okay. And we'll make our way to the next point. Now, I, I am using a website. Whoops. Let's see if I can hold it with the left and go to the right. And the next one will be Santa Fe. That's 450 kilometers. Okay, that was not too bad of a landing. A little bit of bounce, though. Sorry, I don't have auto. Uh, where are you? There we go. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Thank you. Let's take some flaps as well. Let's take another level of flaps. So we got here just before night. We don't need a VFR on anymore. You like the outside view on this. Trey, the game is on the end of runway 22. All right. By the looks of it. Yeah, I'm going to see you guys coming in. So this is going to look pretty nice. I, I'll just aim for him. I'm actually going to get my uh, drone camera. Try, which is actually I do remember looking at videos about X-Plane traffic and they they did look a lot better than it does in here uh, crosswind 20 knots 223 so oh that's actually mostly a head headwind all right I can handle Chunk that. has landed I do like this uh, drone camera. I am offline at just a fraction. Yep, okay, I see you coming in. Nice long runway. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Take it down gently, thank you. And there's a guy behind you. Well, we got a bounce. Oh, I'm mostly. Mostly fine, okay. Not Go bad, down nice landing. With the, uh, propeller pitch, thank you. Nice landing. All right, I'm happy with that one. Yeah, it's got some pretty big, chunky wheels on this. All right, so let's actually get over to the parking space so we can uh, lock it up, swap it up for the next route, 66. How about I turn next taxiway? Thank you. Well, I 
need is my t taxing music. Oops, that's zooming in there. Let's actually go for taxi music. Where is it? Look far. Wow, nice sunset. Beautiful. Yeah. Acknowledge the handoff. Thank you. That was an hour and a half long flight. What is the longest flight that you guys have done directly in Flight Simulator? Distance okay. or time? Time. Like non-stop. Like you sit mm. down and you finish it right away. You don't like hit stop and do it the next day or anything. Uh... Well, distance is probably uh, London to New York, uh, or maybe Hawaii to Fiji. I'm not sure which one was longer. Um, I have done three and a half hour streams, but they may not have been a full flight that long. Wait, I, need I did to a request park. twelve hour flight once, but it was I, I didn't stream it or anything. It was from <clears throat> New York to Irkutsk in Siberia. Wow. Alright, Dre's coming in front of me there. Look at that. Didn't have to uh, go oh, far no. for the parking there. Bounce a little bit. Not thank you. Take that. Almost the same spot that they wanted me to go to, so very happy with that. Okay, mate, you need to duck underneath my wing there. <clears throat> oh, we got uh, all green, thank you. Oh, we get that back wheel up in the air, don't we? All right. Turn that off. And stop the music. And somebody's noisy. That's hyperkite bouncing around. <laughs> all right, I'm going to turn off my engines now. My wheel so doesn't turn in the fine. back, so I have to hit the brakes to get it to turn. Yeah, same oh, right. yes. yeah, same yeah, with me. Brakes. It's brake steering, isn't it? Yeah. All right. So, everybody, welcome to Amarillo, the Route 66. And thank you very much for watching. If you've made it this far, like the video, comment down below, and hit the subscribe button. Uh, if you press the bell, you'll also see when I do uh, next video. Uh, coming out there are daily mod videos chunk's got the red nose s3 by the looks of it hyperkite's doing donuts <laughs> all right and Thanks, uh everybody. we will do another route 66 the stars are already out if you haven't already seen chunks i got a channel he has streamed this as well uh, Dre the Grant Gamer also streams but i think he's going to record in this one so if you want to see his uh perspective Go and check out his channel. I have linked both of them in my YouTube channel. Uh, other channels I work with. Thank you. Other than that, everybody, have a great day. Thank Enjoy. you very much. Cheers. Very fun, everybody. Well, anyways, I guess that wraps up for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you guys want more videos like these. And have a good day.